Tuesday on One. Dad! Dad! Your daughter is the only witness to what happened. Hardly groans for sticking me with the tidying up. Enough! I shall have to tell them. If they come round here asking questions, I shall have to, to tell, tell them. Nobody, nothing. Looking for the lost boys. It's not my kind of thing. I want you two to disappear for a bit. Are they going to do that? You've got me to organise it. You do exactly what you have to do. This conversation never happened. Turning up something nasty. Spender, Tuesday, 9.30 on One. 150 years ago, Ireland was an island situated on the Atlantic seaboard of Western Europe. Stop. Facts and figures aren't enough. I have to know how people really lived. Well, Keenan, you know what I'm here for? Unless you're at the estate office in the morning, what your rent in full, you'll be evicted. Maybe we should sell the cow. No, Francie. At least she gives us milk for wee Alice and John Joe. No, I want to hold on to her. Well, finally tonight, a look at our weather prospects. Rain will spread across all counties overnight, and southerly winds will increase again to strong to gale force. It'll turn out quite wet tonight with heavy rain in places, particularly over hilly areas. The temperature will be steady at 4 or 5 Celsius and will rise slightly by dawn. The rain will continue on and off through the early part of Sunday morning, but all parts will brighten up by midday. It'll be very windy with a maximum temperature of 5 degrees and winds up to 60 miles per hour expected during the afternoon, that especially in the northwest of the province. Showers will develop in many places before dusk, gradually turning wintry. And those are the rather wintry weather prospects. Well, now with the time approaching quarter to two, we've come to the end of programmes for today on BBC One Northern Ireland. A reminder, of course, that as usual, Radio Two is your companion right through the night. Alan Dedicote at the moment is your host on Night Ride. Now, this is John Ash on behalf of everyone remaining in Broadcasting House Belfast, wishing you a very good night. <laughs>